Hello everybody and welcome back to more Kingdoms of Amalur, The Legend of Dead Cal DLC. Alright, so we are now headed to kill the Scion. Let's just follow the main road and it'll take us there, I think. Let's hope. Um, I hope that's not a big divider here. It kind of... oh wait, there is a way up. Okay. What the f fuck? Oh. Okay. Um, it is a fire sprite though, so this isn't gonna damage it too much. Well, that was certainly easier than I thought it would be. There's an off chance that there will be a lore stone there, but you know what? Who cares? Wait, who are you? Watcher? You must face the caller. Wait, why are you all in my way? I don't get it. Feel the power. No thanks. Children of Arathel. Okay, I guess those are the people who are protecting her from intrusion. Makes sense, I guess. Where is this? Right here. Lots of gems, that's nice. Hello, Watcher. Whoa! You must face the Kara! The power. It's nice though, it seems to be able to interrupt him quite well. Ow. Although there is a second guy now. That's not nice. For the exile! Looks like we're getting a Children of Arathel set here. Wait, there's... this. Well, lots of gems here. Hmm. Alright. Scion, can I talk to you first? What do you wish from the Scion, yes. Frail One? Don't you know that I am to be replaced? Akara prepares the successor. It's interesting that I can just have a fucking chat with her before I stop talking to her and just kill her. I was once called Pima. Like many on this island, I was a castaway, left for dead on the beaches of Gallows End. I underwent the offering ceremony when I was a younger woman, back when I didn't know what the future held. I have been the Scion ever since. The Watchers have been on this island for as long as anyone can remember. They protect the Scion, and they defend Akara's interest wherever they may be. Interesting. The Benevolent One is more powerful than any of us can truly grasp. His magic reaches back to the ages of Amalur, nearly to the beginning. His only wish is to protect those who seek solace in this life, to withdraw from the clamor and death of the outside world. He is peace. I wonder if I'm supposed to be allowed to talk to her or if this is like some weird bug. The villagers are Akara's flock. They translate his wisdom into practice, 
making our world a better one. This is where Akara chose to create his perfect world, where he could watch over mortals and aid them in their quest for contentment. Okay. Great. You must face Akara. See, uh, I'm not sure that I was meant to be able to talk to her, but then the fact that she does have dialogue means either that there is a path in which you don't kill the scion, or you know. Or you are meant to be able to talk to her. But it just feels weird because I was able to talk to the watcher this watchers that I just killed as well. Like I had the option for one of them, but I just didn't take it. Interesting how neither of us are falling off at this point. Hakara's visage. Hmm. Very nice, very nice. For those of you wondering why I keep my talisman, um, it's because it has plus one to sorcery. Where's Tari? Meet Captain Bradigan. What? Oh, Tari's over there. For whatever reason. <laughs> why? Why is Tari over there? Bradigan's up there too. Oh, those two are about to meet. <laughs> that should be interesting. E Burgess, not really interested in fighting you, but okay. I think these two weapons are like the only ones that I really like. Uh, Fayblade and uh, Chakram. Yeah, should I go visit the pile? Nah. I think the piles won't have map fragments in them. Usually it's spin chests. And another lore stone that I care so much about. And so rose the river, and so fell the chain armor, the helms of iron, as bards sang thick and bedding beckon. The fuck are these things? Bogarts? They don't seem to be responding to me whatsoever. Okay. Uh, enjoy your nap. Damn this camera, man. My god. Bones cracked and bodies beaten as she painted the walls with another one. This one's not even done. Well, now it is. <laughs> Jeez, ready to prove me wrong. A cursed black sun rose high over half in the hall. With dull blades drawn, they rose from cups, awake with horror as silence gripped the By mandate of the high spear, all warriors heeded the call to hunt the beast frog to blood pall and fasting. With steel talon reach and venomous tongue they marched in her name. Unrun, Shadow Queen.
Okay. What the hell? What is this? What's going on here? Hello? Hello? Kinda creeped out by, like, the supreme silence reigning right now. What's- what is this place? Hello? What offering? Where have oh. you been? Everyone is waiting for Alder's wife to come up here and do something. Not sure what exactly. Wait, you're standing they right next to Tari. The Scion is meant to enter the ring of the Watcher and accept the blessing of Akara. Whatever that means. Don't look at me. I've never done this before either. Wait, so I'm not going to tell her that Alder is... What? She just said they're waiting for their his wife. So why is she suddenly saying waiting for me? And how are these two not like, What the fuck? You're alive? Blah, 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 blah. Why is that not going on right now? <laughs> Talking Cape Solace says that you were to be the next scion. Yes. I don't know what this means. Uh, do you know what I should do? The next sign must enter the ruins. There he will receive the blessing of Akara. I had the chance, but it was taken from me. Uh huh. Go, do what you came to do. I thought I was. Why can't I do the fucking other quest thing now? Oh, whatever. Why do you wound me, stranger? The Alpha despise me, the gnomes fear me, but with you I have no conflict. My ship, my crew, my island, you've taken everything. But you will not have the blessing of Akara. It is my birthright. I'm so confused. I thought you were just like some crazy villainous pirate who just wanted to kill everyone. But then here he is being all decent. Like what the fuck? Well not right now, but you know. Saying that he has no, you know, uh, no f qualms with me. You know? That's, that wasn't the right word. Qualms is not the right word there. I don't know why that word came out, but whatever. He's not the character that I was expecting him to be. And it's kind of off-putting, because when you come to this DLC, you kind of expect him to be like this crazy, I don't give a shit who dies kind of pirate, and that's how he's portrayed all the time, but then he's like, oh, I don't have any problems with you, like, we don't have a conflict. That doesn't make any sense. Anyways, why is it your birthright? Have you ever tasted death, my friend? Have you felt her sweet lips upon your cheek? I was a dead man. I had finally found the peace that had always escaped me in life. But then Akara brought me back, took my hand and fished me from my slumber. I did not choose to be... this. When Akara learned what I truly am, he abandoned his creation, leaving me to walk this earth in anguish. He owes me. And what exactly is the blessing of Akara? It is more than these fools realize. So much more. Akara is ancient. All of Armalor has passed before his eyes. The wise and the wicked. And he has passed judgment. When you receive his power, you become one with Akara and his will. The wisdom, the strength, the magic. It is the power to change the world. Well, I am the Scion. Scion. It is a meaningless title. Don't let these fools blind you. They know nothing of Akara, only what he chooses to show them. 
There is no scion. There is only the power and the one who receives it. You've lost everything. As long as I walk this island and sail those blue waters, I will seek what is rightfully mine. No one tells dead Kel when to die. Not Akara, not you. That is one power I still possess. Well, I'm going to bury you. Have you learned nothing on Gallows End? Hmm? Fate cannot be chosen. It is thrust upon you, and as Akara dragged me from the heavens, I will drag you down to hell. The Baronet is eager to meet you, especially after what you did to his friends. What the fuck? Run, run, little one! I'm kind of confused. Wait, are the other people helping me? Oh, they are. Oh, nice. I'm kind of confused, though. Any attack against any of them counts? I like how Tori still has an arrow over his head. like it. Oh no, is Tori... Oh wait, my chakrams are still broken, aren't they? He was by far the easiest of the three. Chakrams? Not as good as my chakrams, but let's see. Oh, they look cool too. Actually, didn't I used to have chakrams that kind of look like these? Maybe not. No, no, I didn't. They just had a similar little pattern thing. Interesting. Anyways, um, switching back to my other one because it's actually better. See, this is what I mean. Like, I would love to have chakrams that look different now. You know, I'm kind of tired of this. And let's actually fix it up while I have it in my hands. If I can find the fucking... Where... Where the fucking... Oh my goodness. Lady... Plus. Wow. They wear out real fast. Alright. Tori. I didn't think we'd walk away from that fight. Well done. The Baronet finally met his match. Old Key is here. That's never a good sign. I wonder what he wants. Uh, what? Dead Kel almost interrupted the offering, but he failed. I know that. Speak with Key. I he was here. The I was talking to him. Speak to the Fate Weaver. I want to talk to you about your stupid wow. fucking quest. Never fucking mind, jeez. Surprised to see me? Not really. The truth is that you drew me here, not Akara. I've tried time and again to see your path, to read your weave, but I find nothing in the magic. Yet. 
I have seen something new all on my own. It is hope, an opportunity to end the threat of dead Kel once and for all. That is what the scion is meant to be. What you are. You are Akara's attempt to fix his own mistake. Go now, deep into Akara Tor, but do not go alone. You're destined to be joined by another. Um, I'll take Tari. Interesting. You chose the boy. He is impetuous, yes, but he is driven and a fighter. You could do worse. I'm taking Tari because he seems like the least annoying of the three. Because I've been with Nina before and she was annoying. And Brad again, don't even get me started, okay? Alright. Uh, you have claimed a powerful blessing of Akara, the ancient being that has dwelled beneath the mysterious island of Gallows End since the dawn of time. Sweet. Okay. Dead Kel awaits. Did something just open? Yes. Alright, can I talk to you, please? I'm ready. I've been preparing all my life to meet Akara. Can I please talk to you about your fucking quest? I can feel Akara's Jesus presence. Jesus Christ. Alright. Fine. Fine. Let's not talk. Let's just go in the freaking hole, okay? Jeez, Tari. All I wanted was to talk to you about the freaking quest, but no. Now you're just gonna have a stupid arrow on top of your head the whole time. Great. It's wonderful. Fear the darkness. Wait, a secret wall? Ready. Ooh, hello. Not that great, but hello nonetheless. Well, at least he'll be easy enough to track on the map. <laughs> He's a big fucking circle. Why exactly are we in here again? We're just going after Mr. Kel? Whoa. You wanna help, Tari? No? Okay. Jeez. What the fuck? Why didn't that work? Feeling rather horrible at the moment. There we go. Getting kind of annoyed by the fact that I can't talk to Tari about his stupid quest. Like, really? really shows some um oh great what I was about to say is that really shows a kind of like lack of foresight in in uh programming Jesus Christ I really really hate Kratos yeah, take those hits for me. Oh, did I just seriously do that? See, 
his little ambient conversation isn't fucking annoying. <laughs> like Tar- or not Tari, um, Nina and Bradigan. Up or down? Let's go up, because that's the wrong way to go. This seems to be leading, like, way far from the actual way, so I'm a little bit concerned, but... Whatever, I guess. What the fuck? Oh, it's a bog thrush. I've never seen a bog thrush like that before. Um, what the fuck? What the fuck? I, is this a new kind of bog fish? I guess so, because it's new. It's floating around and um, its projectiles are different. Hey Tari, you wanna join in on the fight a little bit? Cause you know, could use the help. Or you know, just sit there. That's fine too. <laughs> this game, man. It's pretty freaking buggy and holy shit, it's like just going way opposite direction. You guys are probably yelling at me. <laughs> Don't go that way. Go do your fucking quest. Oh well. I wanna explore, I wanna see what's over here. Um, uh oh. Okay, well, this looks like it ends pretty quickly. Another bog thrush, really? Fudge cakes! your fucking root shit here. Oh, he's aiming towards Tori. I'm ready. No, 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 no. Been preparing. Let's finish this. Alright. We've come all this way. This better be a good thing. Armor crush, huh? What does that give me? Something horrible, I'm sure. Something horrible that I don't really care about. Oh, not stats. Effects. 50% armor. Woo! That's bad. That's really, really bad. That's okay. More challenge, right? Anything for loot. I'm guessing I want to do the side little places first because they're going to lead nowhere while the middle one is going to lead somewhere? Question mark? And really. Ok, 
came all this way for some freaking nope. flowers. And to be ambushed by the Lianchi behind me. Great. Great. Fucking great. Ah, oh, fuck. She moved. Movement is not encouraged. Please stand still. Surely, the best use of our time. Okay. Let's go in the middle now. No! Oh! Is this gonna be a whole roundabout and I just went the... coming back direction? Okay, well, I'll meet you guys back at the right direction.